going on the road and we're taking the Project Daymaker RV with us. We're going to be serving people in need at homeless shelters, Ronald McDonald houses, and making their day by providing beauty services to them. This is Care 11 News at 5. Six lonesome ladies from Minnesota sat down today for some military makeovers. And as Carol Evans' Roxanne Battle tells us, there is perhaps none who deserve it more. The Twin Cities News Station. Six military wives enjoyed a half day of pampering at Jute Salon Spot today. He's a renowned stylist and author, and he has little things you can do to make your life and the lives of those around you a little bit better. His new book is called Life as a Daymaker. It is April 15th, and if you're feeling taxed, well, Lara Spencer has just the thing for you. Lara? What I have for you is David Wagner. David owns nine hair salons, but he's changed his business card from stylist to daymaker. That's somebody who goes through life with the intention of making people's days. He's written a book called Life as a Daymaker, and in it, David, you propose that we can change the world by small random acts of kindness. No, no, how, how are you making people's days? It only takes a moment to make someone's day and be a daymaker, and those moments can change lives. It can have a profound ripple effect on society, I think. Check in with Lara Spencer and David Wagner, who's giving those tax day makeovers to three women, cheering them up. Well, we want to talk about the fact that this is all part of Project Daymaker. The Mobile is traveling to 17 cities doing random acts of kindness, making the day of ladies and men who really, really need it. And I think it's a wonderful idea. Thank you for making our day. Oh, it's my pleasure. Thanks for having great? me. Thank you. Looks great. They no really? kidding. Thanks, David. Can what a nice around? thing to do. I'll be here all day. Yeah. <laughs> nothing, nothing like uh, 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 the a bouquet of just an act of kindness. No kidding. It's so nice. We'll be back in a moment. It's great. This is CBS 4 News at 6. The military makeovers are compliments of a trendy salon on Miami Beach. What an awesome idea. And a South Florida salon does its part to have military wives do an about face. In otro orden de cosas, dice el refrán que a la situación difícil hay que ponerle una buena cara. Y eso es precisamente lo que hicieron hoy las esposas de muchos militares. This is News to Houston, first at 4. A national book tour is putting smiles on some Houston faces. Author David Wagner is turning his national book tour into a way to make someone's day. David Wagner joins us right now here on Sonoran Living. Actually getting ready to walk inside the Project Daymaker RV. You've got a bunch of products. Are these things that everyone uh, yeah, gets? Uh, Aveda has generously donated and is actually sponsoring the RV to go around the country to the 17 cities. And they've got gift, uh, gift sets for the people at the Ronald McDonald houses and everybody that shows up for the, the book signing tonight. At changing hands. Gomi, David, learn wh what it takes to be a daymaker. For the first time, you may choose to celebrate Daymaker Day. What is it? Inez Gray, owner of local spa and salon Habitude at the Locks in Seattle, is live to explain. Good morning, Inez. It's here where the first annual Daymaker Day is going to be taking place. Actually, salons all around the country are doing it, but the Gage is doing it right here in San Diego County, and they are catering to pamper to the kids of Children's Hospital in San Diego and their parents. Where the news comes first. Wives of local military personnel enjoyed a free makeover today. Now National Daymakers Day is being picked up by hair salons and cosmetology classes across the country. Well, coming up here on Sunrise, one author's idea on making someone's day and how it can change the world. We're going to be talking to this guy. It's David Wagner. And if you will listen to this man for like two seconds, he will change your world for the better. CBS 4 News at 6. From San Diego's more local news station. WSYT Syracuse. Good morning, America. I'm Charles Gibson. I'm Diane Sawyer.